Hello, I'm the Franchise King, Joel Labava. Today, I'm gonna to talk about speed, quickness, the best way to get revenue going for your new franchise operation, and hopefully turn it into profitability. Before I do that, please hit subscribe below and click the bell so you can get notified immediately when I publish new, helpful, useful, profitable videos on all things franchise. Let's get going. Today's topic, what is the best way to get revenue quickly, to get that cash register, to get that credit card machine going so you can get revenue and then hopefully turn it into profit, pure franchise profit. That's what you want, right? Here's how to do it. And it's really not a big secret, but you might not have thought about it. The best way to do it is to choose an existing franchise opportunity to own. There are franchises for sale within 20 or 30 miles from you, I'm guessing. It's just a probability kind of thing. There are businesses for sale for sure within driving distance of you, but you just don't know about them. And some of those businesses are franchises. The reason you don't know about them is because they are sold by business brokers, usually local business brokers who have signed a confidentiality agreement with the franchisee. Uh, that way the employees don't find out it's, it's for sale. So it's usually not public knowledge. So why does buying an existing franchise, a franchise that's up and running, the best way to quick revenue? Because there's revenue coming in already. And hopefully, if you buy it at the right price, that revenue can turn into profitability quickly. Depends on the loan, depends on how much money of your own you're going to put in, depends if the owner is going to finance a portion, depending if you, you know, also could depend on getting you, you know, you getting a small business loan, SBA loan, etc. The point is this, when you start a franchise from scratch, a franchise that may be known, but not known in your region, you're starting at zero. I like it. I like doing it like that because I like the idea of building a business. But some people, maybe you've been downsized, you want to really get your income going quickly. You want to make back what you've been earning. So the best way to do that and the fastest way to do that is by buying an existing franchise. You have to buy one where the numbers look good and where the owner is willing to disclose everything. That is a little challenging at times. And I will tell you that buying an existing franchise is way more complicated and sometimes more frustrating than buying a startup franchise where you're opening a location uh, uh, in, in, your, in your own area and you're, and you're starting from scratch. It's, it's more complicated to buy an existing franchise because you've heard that term, there's two sets of books. Well, there may be two sets of books and the books may be kind of hard to figure out what the numbers mean. That's why you need a small business accountant, someone that knows and is familiar with small business accounting practices and also why you need a franchise attorney to help you go over things if you decide to move forward. The best way to find an existing franchise in your area is to find a business broker in your area. Ask any business attorney. They may know of a broker. You can also go to the International Business Brokers Association website, ibba.org, and just do a search in your local area code or zip code, and you should be able to find a few brokers and ask them, call them up, do an interview, ask them if they have any franchises for sale in their inventory of businesses. That said, the fastest way to get revenue and hopefully profitability in a franchise business is to buy an existing franchise business. Need help with that? I can certainly help you with the research part, show you how to do it, etc. I'm the Franchise King, Joel Lababa. Go to thefranchiseking.com and I will be happy to assist in anything franchise. Thanks for watching.